Welcome back, guys and girls. We return with Spider-Man Edge of Time. We're here as 2099, about ready to escape out of this crazy building. And try to go help our good friend Peter Parker in the past. Let's see. Riding this thing up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Peter. Peter Parker. Who's that? Who's talking? Miguel O'Hara. The Spider-Man from 2099. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Are, are the other me's in my head, too? No. It's just me and you, old-timer. I threw together a chronal link program using a sample of your DNA. It's allowing me to communicate with you at the point in time it was taken. I just wish it was from earlier on. We have almost no time. Time until what? Until you're killed. Un Whoa. Until what now? Because it kind of sounded like you said kill. Listen, a lunatic named Walker Sloan from 2099 created a time gateway. It was a one-way trip that dumped him sometime in the 1970s. He then used his advanced knowledge to build Alchemax, years before it was supposed to be established, transforming your world and mine. But I work for Alchemax. You're saying that's somehow wrong? Completely. At this point in time, you earn a living taking news pictures for J. Jonah Jameson. <laughs> the the late-night ranting TV news guy? <laughs> forget it. You can't forget it. Where does this so-called death happen? Sloan's building another gateway on the 66th floor, so he can finally travel back and forth. I saw you being killed, right there. By who? I couldn't make it out. It doesn't matter. Get out of the building. So a crazed killer can wander around the building without me to stop him? No way. Besides, if I find this guy somewhere else, then I'm invincible, because I can only die at the gateway, right? It's not an exact science, Parker. Meaning what? You want to spend an hour getting a crash course on temporal physics? No? Then do what I say. <laughs> You've got a lot to learn about priorities, pal. I'm gonna do what I think is right, and that means going after bad guys. You want a Spider-Man who'll do whatever you want? Go play a video game. <laughs> Looks like we're switching roles once again here. Uh-oh, we're in the building with Mr. Amazing here. Oh, jeez. This guy. Did he rock? What is going on? Venom? He's the one gunning for me? But he's reformed. Hostile intruder detected in sector AC78. Uh-oh. Spider sense, okay? Ooh. Nice. Spider-Man can use his spider sense to detect enemies through structures or identify those holding security keys. Know by instinct the way to his next objective. I like it. Good thing we have this. That's spiffy new tech. Because uh, there's some serious wormhole, time melding, dimension warping nonsense going on here that we have to go figure out between like how does Spider-Man 2099 know that he should really be working at the Daily Bugle when right now he's working at Alchemex? Like what the heck? But what did you say? I can't hear you. We need to work out the kinks of this time travel communications thing if it's gonna have any hope of catching on. Parker, focus on what's important. I am, which is why I'm heading up to the 66th floor. If that's where we're supposed to butt heads, maybe I could draw them out en route. I'm gonna go look for an elevator. Do you want to die? Of course not. I want to run away even less. Hmm. I, I like how they put him like in the little, uh, little like picture and pic- Whoa! The picture and picture thing like that, that's pretty sweet. Now, I meant to activate that challenge, except I was waiting for the dialogue to be finished, and then the dialogue finished and the challenge was gone, so next time I'm just gonna activate those right away. So we pick up action figure after action figure here. Can we? Let's see, can I climb up the surface here? Yeah, buddy. Climbing up anything, because I am freaking amazing Spider-Man. So, whoa, dude, come on. I need some power-up orbs here. Climbing up, even on glass. He's even got the web tech for glass. Oh, jeez, we're on the under, the wrong side of it, dude. I want to try to get back up there. Okay, I cannot, I cannot want to get every single power orb. It will drive me insane. So, please, please remind me that I can't, uh... Come and go so quickly here. Ah, I cannot get every single purple orb, otherwise I will drive myself insane. Okay, not every purple orb. Learn your lesson early, Ghost Robo. I'll try to get as many as I can, but collecting every single one is going to be nigh impossible. I'll web you all. Okay, so they control a little bit differently. I mean, he's still got the same basic melee, but he's got more web long range attacks. He's a little bit slower, a little bit more methodical. And it'll be interesting to see what, if there, what major differences really take shape, if any, or if it just tries to keep it consistent so you know what you're doing all, you know, the whole time. But who's laughing at me? This guy down here? Don't laugh at me. You're a freaking guard. 
Oh yes, homing attack. I like it. Have some Spider-Man rocks. Boom, baby. Alright, let's get out of here. Elevator riding. Purple orb collecting. I like it, I like it, I like it. Almost have a thousand. That's pretty sick. Repeatedly press B to pull. Whoops, I don't want to cancel. Okay, that... Eddie Brock is freaking... Dude, I'm out of here. Here we go. Here we go. Uh oh. Oh jeez. Whoa there. What happened? The elevator I'm in just changed into a closet. <laughs> Rock just tried to kill me with an elevator. Weird coincidence. Maybe That's not. so weird. Wait, 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 wait. Something I did here had an effect on you in 2099? That's impossible. No, theoretically it's not. The idea is called quantum causality. The two gateways created a link between our times. Like a wormhole through the fourth dimension. Right. Normally changing the past just creates an alternate timeline. But thanks to the wormhole, what you do there affects my time, and vice versa. So I can change things here, now, that can immediately change things in the future? That's amazing. Spectacular, even. Pretty much so, that's what I'd say. I wonder if there's going to be any weird puzzles where we have to go back and forth, or if it's just going to kind of be... Like, oh, you're him for a long time, then you're him for a long time. You know what I mean? How how often they'll, we'll switch or how much they're going to use that back and forth mechanic or what they're going to do with all that. It'll be interesting. See how this all pans out. I kind of want to be anti-Venom, though. That would be pretty awesome to be him. Albino white Venom, I like it. More vent crawling. Both Spider-Mans can do this pretty well, huh? Boom. Okay, there's some serious force field work going on up here. I want to get inside there. Get my red gem. I guess it's just a health upgrade. Alright, we've cleared the thousand barrier. Woohoo! Alright, so... Where are we heading, buddy? Looks like there's something to break over here. The entrance is blocked. I gotta come huh. back here after I take out the security mainframe. Parker, All right. my path to the 66th floor is blocked by some kind of force field. Welcome to my world. All right, let's go try to take out this force field. We'll be back in a second for that red orb. Uh-oh. Weird dude running away. Red lights of laser doom. Think this calls for a job for hypersense. Come on, oh, that, that, hang on, let's go. Fill it recharge. Whoop. There we go. Health upgrade I didn't really need because I have full health. Yeah. Disable Hi, the force um, field. Is it okay with you if I destroy <laughs> that security mainframe behind the glass? Protect security mainframe. Eh, it's worth a shot. The dialogue's pretty good so far, huh? I got some good silly lines. Some good Spider-Man one-liners trying to really... I know they're going back to more of a comical Spider-Man, the new movie. Um, the remake or whatever you want to call it. They're going back to a, a much more uh, quick-witted, wise-cracking Spider-Man than the brooding, moody Toby. Uh, what's his name? Thank you for shopping. Uh, uh, Toby Maguire. That's what I'm saying. Toby Maguire, Spider-Man. I can't turn on my Spidey vision, although it's kind of goofy looking. So I'm gonna let it go. All right. That is glass, and we're crawling on the ceiling. So let's use our key. I'm about to destroy the security mainframe. How you doing, O'Hara? You still stuck? Yeah. Well, listen and learn, baby. That's all both our problems, right? My force field just changed into centuries. Robot oh, geez. Guards. This whole quantum causality thing is a real wild card. I can't control Tell if me it about makes it. things better or worse. <laughs> well, at least I can get through the door now. I would not want that power. I'd be like, hey, mom, I got rid of, you know, all your financial troubles. Instead, you have five arms. I don't know. Amplified expanse by Red's combat skills help when facing bigger and tougher enemies. Access the upgrades when you unlock the time paradox. Alright, I like that. I like upgrades. I didn't know how much there was going to be. I know there were some in Shattered Dimensions. Welcome to the upgrade system. Here you can buy upgrades using Portal Energy and Golden Spiders. First upgrade is Time Paradox. Hmm. Okay. Left plus right stick. I'll buy that. It co what does it cost? Free. Boom. Web navigation. Jump moves. Wear launchers. la di da da Quite a bit here. So, like... Okay, that's already been bought, obviously. Jumping. Um. 
Why do can I not buy these right now? I need to be progress further in the game. So right now, I guess I can't buy anything. Character upgrades. Okay, and then here's twenty ninety nine. All right, so we'll just let the game carry us for a little bit here. Let's try this time paradox thing. It's in the box. Boom. Oh, yes. So Temporarily unlimited. Could it run Everyone's frozen. Affecting my time as well as yours? Destructive actions generate residual dimensional energy. When glowing, the energy can be combust into a time paradox. Gotcha. So we... Because it's happening. All the bad guys just froze. And by that, I mean it's possible. Huh. <laughs> All right. So we do damage. We get a time paradox. It's pretty good. At least that's what it seems like right now. I guess it's temporarily unlimited because they're just letting us test it out, maybe. That's probably why. So we knock them in here and they freeze. Alright, time to get out of this room. Ooh, I like it. Portal energy. Gimme, 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 gimme. Om um, nom 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 nom. Alright. Where am I headed? Right here? Uh oh. Okay. Now to get back to that sealed door through the elevator shaft. Yup, let's skill do it. Be down by now. Oh, wow. That really hurt. <laughs> I didn't know those things were going to come back. Wow, wow, wow. Good work. Wow! Don't do that. Okay, we can go here. But then I want to go there. Get that. Yeah, buddy. Zoom! Here we go. Let's pull this door down. Spider-Man has arms of steel, apparently. Ooh, we're in a hotel lobby or something. Alchemax lobby, I guess, but it looked kind of like a hotel lobby. Right, they're not... <laughs> that's, a great, that's a great plan. I'm, I'm all for that. Don't come at night, otherwise if you get killed, we're not responsible. Like, what? It's pretty goofy. All right, what's up, guys? Time to turn around. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I gotta climb back up here. Why am I falling? I don't want to fall. Okay. Jump. Who's the guy with the key? There's a bunch of guys with the key. That guy has a key. Thanks for the key. All right, so just like that. Oh, I need three keys. One down. All right, so I'm filling up. You can see my purple paradox meters filling, filling, filling. Where are my key boys at? Downstairs. All right. One guy's over, way over there. Holy cow! This guy's right here. You have a key, sir. Give me that key. Thank you. Nope, you're not dead yet. All right then. Now you are. That's my key. And then the other key is okay over here. He's just chilling on the ground. What's up, friend? Get away from me. Give me your key, and no one will get hurt. I don't like their like little uh, sonic boom buster he's got going on here. <laughs> hey, there we go. Can I break this glass? No. It's glass made of extra strength. Then again, webs probably aren't that strong, so... I don't know how they'd break any any glass or any anything. Health orb. Does this just refill our health, or how does this all work? I didn't know if it upgrades our health. I think it just refills. Throw those keys. I'm through the door. Goodbye. Whoa. You're holding back, Eddie. Challenge. Are you restricted area in under 30 seconds? All right, let's try it. Whoa. I'm dizzy. Jeez, oh, Pete's. You realize this time travel story of yours is gonna cost me my job. It's not your job. It's not even your reality. Yeah, that's what you keep saying. But how do you know? Because I do. And deep down, so do you. Now let me concentrate. I have my own problems right now. Yeah, well, I can't help you with that. Maybe you can. Parker, you're making this harder for me, not easier. I told you trying to control this quantum causality thing was a stupid idea. They said penicillin was stupid, too. You're talking about the fabric of reality, not bread mold. Just get ready to help me. Bread mold. Sheesh. I cannot believe his crust. I don't know how I was supposed to get there in 
30 seconds. It's taken me already 55, and I feel like I'm not getting any closer. I gotta get to the ceiling. Peter, you gotta get to the ceiling, man. There we go. All right. Oh, jeez. Dudes are coming in. All right, we got an upgrade available. I'm running whoa there. Let me through. There. Oh, jeez. The elevator I need is right at the end of this hallway. Parker, I'm in a jam, and you put me there. Hey, I was having a quiet evening until you started... What? Defeat ten enemies in one minute. All right. Talking inside my head. Don't blame me for this. All right, fine. What do you need me to do? O'Hara? Great. He's gone. <laughs> I can't help you if you don't answer my questions, dude. Okay, one enemy dead. Use our webs to our advantage is what they said, right? I don't like the Sonic Boom things. That, that makes me all woozy. Two out of 30. Two out of 10, I mean 30. Gosh, if I had to be 30, that'd be awful. There we go. There's three. Stop screwing around and get me out of this. I'm not a time travel expert. How do I... Wait, 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 wait. What if I just trash the robotic research facility? Is that worth a try? Anything's worth Oh, jeez. Stop yelling at me. I'm just learning about this whole quantum causality thing. Learn faster. Okay, I'm there. I'll destroy the prototype parts and we'll see what happens. At least one of us will. Go into a restricted area. Let's go. Got more dudes to destroy here. Where are we headed? Press B. Pull this thing down. I'm so strong, I'm gonna rip it down with all my might. Well, bam. All right. That work for you, buddy? Not quite. Okay, so where are we headed? Where are we headed? Um, let's see. Probably up here. Let's go up. I don't have much time left to defeat my enemies. Get there, get closer. Yeah, remember to use your web shots. Thanks for the reminder. I forget about those. Okay, I've got 12 seconds. Is depending on a theory. Believe it. Beans. Uh, these challenges are ridiculously tough in, in terms of the time frame. There wasn't even 10 enemies in a minute 30 to see. Boom. You still with me, O'Hara? Faster! Faster would be better! I'm doing my best! Best! Not good enough! No! O'Hara! Hang on! I'm trying, bud. I gotta just rip off this guy's head quickly here. Then he'll be dead and disappear in your world, too. I hope. Shazam. O'Hara, there's nothing left here in the trash. Are you still there? Yeah, for the most part. Do they turn into something else? Like, I don't know, kittens? Yeah, small, metal, robotic, killer kittens. Aww. Oh, jeez, now I'm back at 2099 fighting these dudes. Get me out of there. Kind of proves the oh my god! Theory. Now just tell me who wins the next ten World Series and we'll call yeah. you. Yeah. <laughs> world what? You're killing me, O'Hara. I'm not, but you will if you go to the 66th floor. 66th floor, I know. And we both know I'll do what I have to. Okay, fine. If plan A, keeping you out of danger, isn't working, then we'll go for plan B. I'll get down to my own 66th floor, see if we can solve this thing. I'll try not to die. Decoy. Oh, for those missiles. Blow up the decoy. I got a spider thing. I don't even know how. I guess it was trapped inside an enemy or something. These robots are relentless. Oh, I, I gotta have him hit the lock. Bust that lock. I'm out of here. Goodbye, boys. There are too many of you. Rip it down. Oh, gosh. Okay, this is not gonna work. Uh, get away. Get away from me. Actually, ah, I, I wanted to. Crap. Boom, blow them up. Android 29, what are they talking about? Okay, there's so many of these guys. Okay, just get away from me. I gotta repeatedly rip down the door. Ouch. No, this is not gonna work. Oh my god, okay, I guess I have to kill all these guys. Decoy. Blow you up. Two left. Ouch. Okay, now we can do it. Rip the door down, please! Oh my gosh. One dude left being a jerk. Let's see how it is. You gotta be done for, man. Okay, there we go. The turret is down. Missile pod number whatever over here. Blah, I'll mar you with my webs. 
Blah, blah, blah. Good work. Thank you. All right. Phew. That room took forever to clear out. With that, we're going to wrap this episode up. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you're enjoying the longer, longer look we had this time at the game. It's pretty darn cool so far. I like the switching. I like the combat. I like the story. Have to see what happens next time in part three. Hit that like button, add your favorites if you're enjoying it as well. It helps me out a lot, and I really appreciate it. Until next time, guys, have a fantastic day, and we'll see you all later.